Well, hopefully you're prepared for even colder temperatures as you head outside tonight and tomorrow morning. This will be the coldest night that we've had since mid-February. Uh, in Flint, our forecast low of 5 degrees tonight will be the coldest that we've seen since February 17th. Actually a degree colder uh, when it was 6 degrees on that particular morning. In Saginaw, the forecast low tonight also 5 degrees. And the last time we were that cold was also on February 17th of 2013. This is what we're looking at in terms of snowfall. Really not much. Pausing the clock at midnight here, you can see that Futurecast has us at mo mostly cloudy, even though I do think we'll have some breaks in the cloud cover. At 8 in the morning, you can see partly cloudy skies depicted across the area as we head into the afternoon. In and out of the clouds at 5 o'clock, you can see Futurecast showing mostly cloudy skies. Maybe a flurry or two in the thumb, not looking at accumulating snow though tomorrow. On Friday, we'll have to watch out for some snow showers. Could be a few flurries as we head through the day at 8 o'clock as we head through the afternoon. A bit of a break and then towards evening the snow develops again as an area of low pressure to the south of us approaches southern Michigan. For tonight a low of 5 degrees, partly cloudy skies, wind chills as cold as 12 degrees below zero thanks to westerly winds 10 to 18 gusting up to 25 miles an hour. 18 degrees for a high tomorrow. This is still colder than our average low for this time of year. Average low is 22, so we're going to be below that for our high even. Wind chills hovering around zero. Could be a few flurries over the course of the day, but really not that big of a deal. Your seven day forecast on Friday. Look for some snow developing at night after a somewhat milder high of 24 degrees. We'll drop to 18, 25 with snow likely on Saturday. Could see a couple to three inches or maybe even a little bit more than that of snowfall accumulation. It's something we'll watch as we continue to approach Saturday on Sunday. Mostly cloudy skies could be some snow redeveloping towards late afternoon and evening. A high of 22, a low of 13. So a cold weekend, but not quite as bitterly cold as it's been the last couple of days. And the temperatures next week still colder than average, but not quite as cold as we were thinking earlier. By and large, highs will be in the 20s and lows will be in the teens. Could be a few flurries on Tuesday.